That is what I am talking about. When you weigh a lot, like I do, like I have a lot of weight to lose, probably like 40 to 50 pounds, 10 pounds isn't gonna look like much of a difference. So if you're like me and you're starting at like a, like a very big journey where you have to lose like a ton of weight and you, know, you have to trim a lot of fat, if you lose 10 pounds and you don't notice a difference, don't trip about it. Like don't trip about it, measure yourself. You know, those are the best indicators to know that you're making good progress and wear the same clothes. See if they fit looser. Cause sometimes, you know, you'll lose 10 pounds and you'll be like, well, why do I still kind of look the same? And you know, 10 pounds on a person that has a lot to lose like me, isn't gonna look like much of a big difference. But trust me, once, you know, it starts getting to like 12 pounds, 15 pounds, 20 pounds, 25 pounds, you're gonna notice a huge difference. You're gonna notice a huge difference. But yeah, I just wanna let everybody know that if you lose like 10 pounds and you don't really notice a difference, do not trip, it's perfectly normal, okay? Especially if you have a lot to lose. If you don't have a lot to lose, say you have like 15 pounds to lose and you lose 10, which is amazing by the way, you're gonna notice a huge difference. But yeah, if you have a lot to lose and um, you lose 10 and you don't notice a difference, Perfectly normal, all right? What's up everybody, Voice Over J is in the building. I went back to the basketball gym to resume my training. I didn't go for the past couple of weeks because I had to take care of some stuff off of uh, the basketball gym, I guess. I was gonna say off YouTube, but I couldn't make the, the appointments because they're at one. And I wake up around like 12 p.m. So I'm straight out the bed. Shout out to these two right here. This is Dominic. This dude is so freaking quick and he's so shifty with the ball. And my guy Clay right here, this dude's a bucket. They're actually looking up my channel right now. I think Clay is. I think Dominic is putting on some music or something. There's copyrighted music in the background. That's why I'm gonna be voicing over this. And you know, he's just now discovering my channel. So he's probably watching this right now. What's up, Clay? So I'm like, what you doing? Yeah, they're looking up the channel right now. They didn't even know I had a channel. They didn't know the channel name. So I'm telling them that I'm doing like a dieting series. I'm doing like a dieting vlog of my journey. But yeah, here's me just getting up some warm up shots. And we're gonna play a game called King of the Hill. We're gonna go to seven points and any air ball, an air ball is when you shoot the ball and it doesn't touch any part of the basket, you get minus one point. And that's gonna be important because later you'll see why I mentioned I almost hit that dude with the ball. All right, so we're about to start the game right now and this is what's gonna happen. Dominic is gonna be guarding me and then Clay is gonna see who he's gonna have to guard. If I make it, I go up against Clay. If I miss it, I don't do anything. So I shot an air ball. The first freaking shot of the day, I shoot an air ball. Watch this dude, this dude is so freaking fast. Look at this man. Look at this man. Oh, she can't even see him because my big ass is in the way. Oh, I didn't even make it though. This is my first offensive possession. Let's see what your boy does. Let's see what Jay does. Ooh, okay, okay. Oh, give me that, give me that, give me that. Nope, nope, yeah. Defensive player of the year over here. I'm kidding. I have a lot to work on. I'm so slow. I've never felt this slow in my damn life. So it's gonna take me a minute. It's gonna take me a minute to get to it. Shit. Oh! Still mid. And I was talking a little shit. Y'all saw that? Y'all saw that? Ooh. Oh, fuck. Oh my god. But yeah, these guys were busting my ass. Check how fast this guy is. Check how fast he is. He's annoyingly fast. Look how fast that was. And look, you guys can see me mouthing the words right here. I was like, he's quick. Fuck, he's quick. <laughs> and yeah, my hair is looking a mess. Because usually I just get out of bed, brush my teeth, and I just go. But yeah, look how fast he is. I'm actually impressed by how fast he is. Oh my goodness. Yeah, check them out, guys. These dudes are buckets. These guys are just straight buckets. And I'm documenting this right now because I just want... Oh, shit. Okay, I actually did pretty well there. But yeah, um, I'm just documenting this because they were torturing me. They put me in a torture chamber, but um... Ooh, fuck. I, I thought I was actually gonna make that. I think I was telling him to shoot that. I, I think I was telling him I don't believe in that. Yeah, I told him I don't believe in that shit. He just straight up made that. I have no idea what the hell they were talking about here, but I'm just checking this ball up. Let's see what he does. Let's see what he does. Damn, look how fast he was. God damn it, bro. Let's see me try to play defense one more time. Let's see. I probably got my ass busted here. God damn, bro. Here we go. Come on, Jay. Lock up. Lock up. Damn. Did you guys see that move? Can I replay that real quick? Look at this. I blinked as he crossed me. Hold on. I blinked as he crossed me. Oh, shit. Bro, I got to work on that. 
My defense is all fucked up. Look at that. Look at that. Oh my god. He left me, dude. He left me in San Diego. He went to a different city with that. Here's another possession of me trying to play defense. Defense is in quotation marks. Yeah, my defense is non-existent. All right, let me see me try to score. Come on, Jay. Come on, Jay. Fuck yeah, dude. Finally. God damn. Started to worry about myself. Hey. Fuck. I actually had more points than I thought, to be honest. Oh, shit. <laughs> I tried to do the thing where you put it through your legs. Oh, yeah. That's what I'm talking about. Come on, Jay. I got three points so far. Oh, that should have been four. All right, here we go. I think he has game point. I think he has game point here. Did he hit that? He freaking hit that. That's game. I feel like watching this back is so great for me because it shows me what I'm doing wrong. And also, I want to mention something about my defensive stance. Since I have like a lot of weight on me, it feels heavy. Like trying to get low like that. Ooh, 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 ooh. Oh, come on, Jay. Bro, you're such a hoe. I can't believe I missed that. Let's see what, ooh. Ooh! Hey! Hey, yo, Clay! Clay Thompson, I don't even know this guy's last name, but I'm calling him Clay Thompson right now. We're looking like a Clay Bompson. That's a nice ass move. That was a nice ass move. This is where the shit talking begins. I say, you ain't scoring on me. That's what I said, I remember saying that. I was like, you ain't scoring this point on me. And he scores on me. <laughs> I said, you ain't scoring on me. Bro, score right on me. Here's a moment that I remember vividly. We check the ball up. I was frustrated. I'm not gonna lie, I was getting frustrated. And I felt like I got fouled right there. So I said, and one. And I told him that he can't guard me. I told him that he can't guard me. And I said that he just fouled me. That's all he does. Ooh, and I missed that. But yeah, I remember I was so frustrated. Like, keep in mind, like, these dudes were busting my ass. I'm gonna be straight up. Like, I don't care about, like, the failures that I have. They were busting my ass. That just motivates me to come back, you know, stronger and faster and just attacking harder. But I was telling him he couldn't guard me. And that's just the thing that gets me hyped up. I was just talking shit. So me and him were talking a little shit back and forth right now. I was talking to him. But at the end of the day, it's all basketball. Just remember that, everybody. Like, if you leave the shit talking on the court and you are respectful off the court, that's just basketball. That's the sport that I love. All right, everybody, I'm going to go through this real quick. I feel like I should have won this game. I feel like I should have won this game. So we're going to seven, right? I feel like I should have won this game. So that's one point, right? That's one point. Um, we're going to seven, but minus one for the air balls. Remember I mentioned that earlier? Minus one for the air balls. So watch this. I don't even know if I score here. <laughs> hey, he just took it from me. All right, here's your boy with the ball again. Ooh, ooh. Okay, okay, okay. Ooh, gave him a little bump. Oh, give me that shit. I like Clay, man. He gives me props a lot. Yeah, good attitude about him. The guy Dom, the one who's guarding me right now, he's more feisty. And I like that too, because that's how I am on the court. Like, I have no friends on the basketball court, unless you're my teammate. And that's just me being real. That's just me being straight up. Like, I'm kind of an asshole. But that's just how I grew up playing basketball, to be honest, because a lot of people on the basketball court talk shit to you. Like, a lot of people on the basketball court talk shit to you. A lot of people who play basketball, did he just pump fake me out my freaking shorts? Wait. Hold on, let me see. Oh my god, bro. Hey, yo, Clay's trying to piss me off, dog. He's trying to piss me off, Clay. Oh, shit. Okay, still got to stop. But yeah, um, people don't give you respect just because, you know, you're on the court. Um, did I make that? I made that. Yeah, they don't give you respect. You got to earn respect on the basketball court. And just because, like, I look the way that I look... And I just score back-to-back -back buckets. Like, you know what I do. Yeah, people don't just give you respect. You have to earn respect on the basketball court. Like, these two people don't know who I am. You know? They're just over here to bust my ass. Am I gonna bust ass? Ah! I have four points, by the way, just to keep track. But yeah, anybody who's played basketball or anything in general know that you gotta earn your respect. Respect isn't given, it's earned. But you can't just automatically get respect. You gotta stop there. I respect myself. Hey, Jay. Basketball Jay. I respect you, boy. But yeah, I got four points. Got four points. Oof. And there's my air ball. Now I got three points. So I had four points. Now I have three points. That's going to be important because I should have won this game. And look at this right here. See how we dapped each other up? That's basketball, man. I was talking shit to him earlier. You know, I was telling him that he couldn't guard me. All he could do was foul me. 
And at the end of the day, it's respect. Like, there's no enemies in basketball. There's only enemies when you're going up against each other. But then at the end of the day, we're all bros. Okay, so I get the ball back. I have three points, right? Now I have four points. So I should have had five right now. I should have five, but I have four because of that air ball. And now I have five, but I should have six. So this should be my game point. I should be almost able to win this. See, that should have been game. That should have been game. But we play minus one for air ball. So now I have six. I have six points. And that barely grazed the rim, so I didn't get a negative one point. But yeah, honestly, I feel like I should have won that. You know why I'm saying that, guys? Because there's a lot more footage here. Um, I think the first game that you saw, Clay won, and then Dominic won like two or three straight. And I said I'm gonna get mine before our session's up because these are only one hour sessions. And uh, I was gonna win this one. I felt like I was gonna win this one. But I only had six, I guess. But I felt like I should have won that because I had seven in reality. Is that just me being petty? Is that just me being petty? I think that's me being petty. All right, so I'm gonna show you all the last clip of this session. Dom has game point. He has six, I have six, and I think Clay has like four or five. So if I can stop him, I get the ball and I get to potentially win the game. But, but he's backtracking a little bit. He's backtracking a little bit. I told him I don't believe in that shot. I told him I don't believe in that game winner. And then he splashes it. He splashes it. But it's all love at the end of the day. And I'm happy that I got to hoop with them because these guys are actually like really good at basketball. But yeah, I'm gonna leave the link to his channel in the description and the link to his channel in the description. I want you guys to check them out, show them some love, especially if you love basketball and you wanna learn some tips and tricks on how to get better and let them know that that dude sent you. But let's go on with the rest of the video. Just got done cooking my food. Let me turn this fan off. And I'm gonna show you all what I'm eating right now. I cooked some shrimp and I made some ground beef. Put a little bit of cheese on there, two servings of cheese. And I am going to eat this while I look for what to record. And you guys just all saw those basketball clips of those guys busting my ass. I'm pretty frustrated by that. Can y'all see me? You can't see me, huh? Yeah, I'm pretty frustrated because, you know, Nobody wants to lose. But I just need to be better, that's all. I mean, that's what happens when you play people that are good. It just pushes you to get better. Tuesday, May, what day is it? May 11. Um, I wanted to go work out, but it is a rare occasion where my mom doesn't have anybody at her house. So, I gotta go get the other dog that you haven't seen. We gotta go get your girlfriend, boy. Ready, ready. No, this way. We gotta go get your girlfriend. You want to go get your girlfriend? You want the world to see your girlfriend? Oh, shoot. What's your baby girl? <laughs> I missed you. <laughs> I missed you. <laughs> Hold on. Let me lay out here. 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 Oh, come on. Come to me. They left. Come on, guys. Come on. Don't make it awkward. Come here, Shikara. Shikara, come on. Raiden, somebody come on this couch with me. Come on. And pause on that. Come on. Somebody come here on this couch with me. Come on, right now. Are you serious? This is what they're doing? This is what we're getting into. Come on. Oh, look, she missed him. She missed him. Hey, why are you smelling this thing, though? Hey, why are you smelling this thing, though? Why are you smelling that small thing? Watch out, baby girl. You're going to come back to my place? You're going to come back? All right, let's go for a walk, then come back. Let's do it. Let's do it. Hey, shout out Little J, though. That's gang time. Look at this. Look at this. Ooh, Hooper. Ooh, look, look. Hooper. Happy Mother's Day, Mom. And that's me when I was a little shit ball. Still a little shit ball. But yeah, that's uh that's young Jay right there. It's my beautiful mom right there. Actually, here's a more recent one. That's me and my mom. We even got a picture of her and Sakura. It's a picture of her and Sakura together. And then there's a picture of me and Max together. And yeah. Uh what's up boy? You wanna go for a walk now? Go for a walk? Is that what we're doing? Walk time? Hey, relax you two. All right, we're gonna go for a walk, then I gotta go back to my place, and we gotta hit that workout, all right? We gotta do it for the gang. Ready, are we doing it for the gang? Yeah, for the gang. to 
trim up the music from this part because for some reason YouTube said it's copyrighted. So boop 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 boop. Better do do do. I'm just gonna sing my old shit and hit these high notes like da 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 da. Oh, you're not gonna take my revenue. Not gonna take my revenue. Oh oh oh. Oh my God. Okay, hopefully your eardrums didn't burst, and hopefully that settled it with the copyright stuff, because I'd rather just sing my own shit than have to mute shit. I actually scratched that. I gotta mute these next few seconds, so here's me doing some push-ups with a cut-off shirt. I thought I was actually gonna be more ripped. Guess not. Oh, guess not. I'm not that ripped yet, but every day is a process. Okay. Back to the video. This is without a doubt the hardest part of my day. And if this is the hardest part of my day, then I think I'm in good shape because I cannot find out what to record right now. I'm looking through Steam, looking through Itch.io, looking through Game Jolt, just trying to figure out what would look interesting on the channel. Like, for example, I got this game right here, right? Souls of the Wind. Nah, that ain't me. That ain't for the channel. Like this? Am I gonna play this? Look like I'm doing computer code and shit. What's this? This game may contain content not- Who cares? Let me see that. Let me see that thing. Prison 69? Really, dude? But like I said, I'm not complaining because I love what I do. Like, I love that I get to do this for a career. This isn't even a job to me. I never call this a job. Like, I just call it making videos, making content for you all because I love this. I love getting into the games that I play. I really put my heart and soul into it. That's why sometimes I can just get so lost into it because I really, really try to put myself in the game and we just go through the experience together. It's not just like a man playing a game and that's it. You know what? Maybe I won't do another free random games episode because I just uploaded one yesterday. It was the Blockbuster one, if you guys saw that. So, oh man, what am I gonna do? I'm waiting for my pre-workout to kick in, but I think it's kicking in. And people think I only listen to hip hop and R&B. Listen to this, look, look. No, I'm not the man I used to be lately. Hey, see you met me at an interesting time. My goal right here is to get at least 10 for close neutral. I'll be so happy if I can get 10. If I can't, you know what, it's cool. Just gonna keep improving every single time. But if I can get 10, I'll be super happy. I got seven of the wide grips, so I'm good off that. But now we're gonna try the close neutral. So let's see if I can get 10. Let's go. Hey everybody, voiceover Jay is back in the building. I was super excited to get 10 pull-ups in one set because I haven't hit 10 pull-ups for one set in a long ass time. So I was extremely proud of that progress because if you guys remember the first back workout I did of this dieting and workout series, I actually didn't even get more than four or five, I believe. And then I'm over here getting 10 now. But the reason why I'm voicing over instead of showing you the other part of the workout is because right after this, I felt extremely nauseous. I don't know what it was. Maybe I took too much pre-workout. Maybe, I don't know. Maybe I just had like a stomach bug. But I felt really weird and I felt nauseous and I felt a little dizzy. So I decided, you know what? I'm not gonna try to force myself and possibly, you know, fuck myself up even more. So I decided to change my clothes and I went to go eat. All right, everybody, here's the finished product. Can you guys even see this? Got the low carb tortilla, the one that I showed you guys in week one. Got some shrimp, got some beef, got a little bit of cheese. And I'm gonna put some Cholula on there, like this. Mm. I'm just watching uh, these two YouTubers, uh, Barwadis and Faze Rug. They're just playing one on one. I like watching any basketball content. I usually watch like video game content or basketball content on YouTube. 
Right now, everybody's playing Resident Evil 8, and I'm trying to play that on the channel, so I don't want any of that to be spoiled for me. So I'm just watching these two play basketball right now. Oh, wow. <laughs> no. Oh my God. Wow. Damn, that was a nice shot. Okay, bro, Wallace, I see you. I see you, my G. Today is Saturday, May 16. I took the other day off because I still felt weird. I still felt a little weak. So I tried to increase my carbs yesterday and just take the day for myself. But now I gotta go back to my back and shoulder workout. I am documenting all this because, hey, sometimes we just have shitty weeks and right now I'm having a shitty week. But if I don't do it, who else is gonna do it, you know? Somebody ain't gonna lift the weights for me. Somebody's not gonna eat good food for me. And what I mean by good food is like food that's good for me. You know what I mean. <laughs> I still feel a little poo But yeah, I got a haircut, just in case you might be like, what the hell happened to his hair? But yeah, time to get this back and shoulder workout in. Let's get it. I just read a tweet that made my day. This person asked me if I will go to prom with them because it's in two weeks, May 27. If you're the person who asked me, shout out to you for asking me that question. Um, I think it's funny because one, I've actually never been to prom. I didn't go to prom when I was in high school. And two, I thought that was really sweet. Hey, I just wanna say thank you, first of all, for asking me to go to prom with you because one, I've never been to prom and you know, I guess I miss out on that part of my life. But two, thank you for asking me. Out of anybody in the world, you know, you could ask anybody, but thank you for asking me. Unfortunately, I don't even know what city you're in, so I'm most likely not gonna be able to go. But I think it would've been cool, you know, especially if you would've been down to let me record, which I'm doing right now for the vlog. Hey, shout out vlog gang! But yeah, um, thank you so much for asking me. I'll be there in spirit though. Like if you end up going, I just wanted to tell you, that's why I'm recording this video, that I hope you have the most amazing time when you go to prom. I'll be there with you in spirit. And shout out to you again for asking me. And I hope you have a great prom. This video footage is from Sunday, May 16, but I'm doing this voiceover on Monday, May 17, 326 in the morning. So if I stumble on my words, if I start talking out of my ass, I apologize, it's really late. But I just wanted to get this video out for you guys on Monday because I know a lot of people have been asking me where the fitness and dieting vlogs are and I wanna make sure that I'm on point. Why do I keep checking out my own ass? Bro, why do I keep checking out my own ass? Like I never look at myself from the back. Does anybody ever really look at themselves from the back? But yeah, I got like a freaking bouncy house back there. But it was Sunday, May 16, like I just said. I am going to go to the basketball gym later with my friends. We're just gonna play, get our cardio in. But I thought, you know what? Why don't I get a little bit loose before we go? I decided that I'm gonna run on the treadmill for a little bit and I'm gonna work on my handles because I really want my handle to get tighter. So yeah, I'm right here trying to practice my handle. Loki look like an idiot right now. <laughs> just going between the legs, trying not to look down. Just working on going high, going low. Actually, I'm not even getting low, but I'm just kind of working on speed. And I'm really trying hard not to look down. And my left hand is my weaker hand, even though I'm left-handed. And I decided that I want to face the camera this time. Okay, all right, Jay. All right, my bad, my guy. Do what you got to do. Do what you got to do. There you go. I'm trying not to look down. And I'm working on my left hand. And sweat got on my freaking eye. That's hard work, baby. That's what I'm talking about. But yeah, I decided that I want to get a little bit loose, work on my handle before I go to the basketball gym with my boys. This is where I made the biggest mistake of my life that day. I have a banana, I have strawberries, I have three scoops of protein, which is about 75 grams of protein. Look, I was throating this protein shake like I was the captain of Team Gok Gok, and this is what killed me when I got to the gym. Like, I had a stomach ache when I went to the gym. I felt like I wanted to throw up. Also ended up eating a bowl of this, which is sweet potato and some turkey meatballs, which was good as fuck, by the way. But I think it was one of the big mistakes before I went to the basketball gym because I'm about to show you guys why. So I get there. I feel like I needed to warm up because, I don't know, I was feeling weird. I was feeling kind of nauseous. So I just wanted to get some form shots in. I kind of bring the ball from the left side like this, kind of like Lonzo Ball and Kevin Durant. But I come up like this at the very end. So as long as your elbow's pointing straight at the very end, I think that's good. But yeah, my, my starting is like this. So I've been trying to just work on coming up like this. If you guys can see me, just focusing on trying to just come straight up instead of a little bit to the left. I started shooting like that because I fucked up my shoulder a long time ago and it was actually pain free when I came this way. That's a little fun fact. So I wanna say two things. One, there's like a bunch of like wet stuff on the camera lens, that's why it looks like that a little bit. And two, today was not my day. 
the guy in the Laker track pants, this guy was killing it. He was killing it. I'm not gonna lie. All my friends that are watching this, he was killing it. Well, okay. He, he made an air ball there, but he was killing it. I promise you he was. And then my boy right here with the ball, Brian, that's my brother right there. He did really well. But I was feeling nauseous the first couple games. That's why I'm not really doing anything. Kind of just standing there, just like feeling sorry for myself. But yeah, I just want to show a few highlights of my boys because they always go to the gym. They're consistent and I love playing with them. So I want to show them some highlights. Like that was a good move right there. Dude, that's actually a pretty freaking hard move. My guy got clean ass hair too. Oh, I see you, my G. But I want to talk to you guys for a little bit while I let this video play out. Um, I'm feeling disappointed about this week because I'm editing the video. This is uh, Sunday night, Monday morning, basically, because I just showed you guys the time. I'm disappointed with this week, mostly because two days I didn't even work out because I was feeling like crap. That one back day where I got the 10 pull-ups on that one set, I was feeling nauseous. And I kind of just took a couple days off Wait, let me see if I can do anything right here. Let me see if I can do anything right here. Okay, I'm getting kind of low. Forcing him baseline. I... Okay. I mean, I, I funneled him to my boy. And he took care of the rest. Oh, shit. <laughs> but yeah, I'm disappointed in myself this week. Mostly because... Hold on. Let me see if I do anything here. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Oh, my God. Bro, I'm trash. I'm Basura. I belong in the trash. But well, let me see if I make this. Come on, Jay. Come on, Jay. You know what I do? You know what I do, boy? Let's go, let's go. Yes, sir. Hold on. I gotta see this, everybody. We gotta see this. Did I make the third one? Yes, I did. All right, so after you make three of those, you check up. And then, you know, somebody comes to guard you. Did you make that? Fuck, dude. I'm trigger happy sometimes. But yeah, I'm disappointed in this week. One, because I didn't even hit abs once. I didn't hit abs once, and core is such an important part of having like a great toned body. So I don't even think I lost any weight this week because I took a couple days off. I did eat well. I, you know, I didn't do anything that would, hold on, hold on, hold on. Ooh, 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 ooh. Um, hey, I'm, I'm just addicted to watching myself score. Hey, you know? You gotta root for yourself. I'm happy. Okay, I made three in a row again. I'm happy about that. But yeah, I'm disappointed in myself, but you know what? It is what it is. And my left hand is ass. My, I might as well be wiping my ass with my left hand because that's all it good for. That's all it good for? Man, that's that 3.30 a.m. talk. Ooh, ooh, come on, defensive player of the year. What the fuck? How? Give him that too? No, you gotta be competitive, Jay. But yeah, next week, I'm gonna be a killer. I'm on my killer shit, I promise you all, okay? This week, I'm actually kind of disappointed. I had fun though. No, I got to play ball a few times, twice this week. What else did I get to do? Um, I don't know, listen to good music. My workouts were shitty. My actual workouts, like when I'm moving the weight, they were shitty, so that's what I'm disappointed about. You know, I'm down more than 10 pounds. We'll see what I am tomorrow morning because, you know, obviously you don't want to weigh yourself this late at night because you have all the food in you, the water in you. You kind of want to go to sleep and see where your weight's going to be after that. And yeah, one thing I want to ask you guys, if you have any questions that you want me to talk about or any topics you want me to talk about while I do the vlogs, let me know. Let me know what you guys want me to do. Damn, what the heck? I know. <laughs> he said I was looking like that picture right there. Michael Jordan and LeBron. Like, come on, man. Hell no. Nah. Hell no. Nah. They always gassing me up. But I don't even know what the hell I have. I actually don't even know what the score is right now. I have something. You guys are counting, right? Hopefully. Remember, you got to score 21. Got to score 21 to end the game. God damn, boy. But don't let this fool you. I was actually playing like crap all freaking day. Look at that. Missed another layup. I should retire before I even start to play anybody. I don't know if I'm being hard on myself about this week, but yeah, definitely my worst week of dieting so far. My mentality is still the same. I, I don't want to let myself down. I don't want to let you all down, but I don't know. I kind of just didn't have it in me. Yo, 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 hey, Jay, talk to him, Jay, talk to him. Damn really about that life huh that was a good ass move oh shit my defense though Ooh. my defense and my left hand 
belongs in the trash. Been wearing that calf sleeve too. If you guys noticed that sleeve on my left leg, because I keep cramping on my left calf. It's never happened to me before. I don't know what's going on. Maybe it's because I'm getting old. Maybe it's because I'm always running or something. But yeah, I, uh, I've been wearing that. It's not for style points. Usually I don't wear any accessories, but... Oh, come on, Jay. Come on, Jay. Score. Score, baby. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> I don't even know when I started doing that shit. That's not even a nice looking move. Kind of looks weird. But that's my favorite spot to shoot right there. The spot you guys always see me shoot at. So I need to start shooting in my weak spots. Because I'm kind of shooting on my strong points because I want to make shots. And my freaking boy, he just keeps nailing shots. In the top to bottom Laker gear. Like it's a double whammy because I don't even like the Lakers. So I have to see that every time I'm getting splashed in the face. Like look at this guy, he don't miss. And he flicks that wrist like his shit don't sting. He's over here going, ah. Okay, I think at that point I have 19. I have 19. So I have to score one more basket in order to win. And my friend in the Laker gear, he's not that far behind. So let's see what happens here. Let's see what happens. RJ has the ball. Let me see if I can commentate. He drives left. He spins right. He takes it. He doesn't make it. Oh, Jay has a chance. Jay has a chance to win the game. He looks at him. He tells him he can't guard him. He pulls up. He scores! <laughs> But yeah, I was pretty much asked the rest of this whole night. Let's do this. Uh, I'm in my robe again, by the way. Let's do that. Yeah, I'm not gonna trip, okay, everybody? Can we see up here? Uh, I hope not, because I'm really naked under here. Like, I'm really naked. So let's see what we're working with. All right. Well, I'll take it. I will take it. You guys see that? One pound down. We were 225.0 last week. Now we are 224.0 this week. So obviously you know I'm gonna go right to my notebook. All right, so for May 17, 2021, I'm gonna put 224.0. And then I put here, I made like a little note, randomly up at 226 on 51321. Water weight? I just wanted to write that little note here. I might do like a couple notes here and there if my weight goes up or I feel a certain way. But yeah, 224, 225 last week. I didn't weigh myself on the third. I accidentally put 225 here, but I actually didn't weigh myself there. Then I was 226.8 there, 228, 231.4, and I started off at 235.2. I did have a low weigh-in of 223 point something. I took a picture of it, by the way, but I feel like I'm kind of retaining water right now. I actually do feel like I'm retaining water, mostly because besides the basketball stuff, I haven't really done much cardio. Like I'll do like 100 calories here and there just to get warmed up, but I'm not doing anything crazy. Like I'm not trying to burn that many calories. I'm sweating a lot during my workouts, but I'm not trying to do as much cardio because I know that I'm doing a lot of basketball stuff, but I might ramp up my cardio a little bit back to like 30 minutes of running or 300 or 400 calories. It depends because you don't want your body to get too used to all the things that you're doing and then you don't lose any weight, you start plateauing. So I don't wanna do too much cardio. So I'm actually gonna really go hard this week. I really wanna see the weight drop this week. I wanna be at least 222. 222 or right under 222, like 221 point something. I'm really gonna go hard. I'm not gonna miss any days, not gonna miss any meals. I'm gonna make sure that I'm not taking in too much high sodium. If I am, I'm gonna make sure that you know I'm sweating my ass off. But you know, I lost a pound this week. Any progress is good progress. I knew that it wasn't gonna be anything crazy, but hey, we're still trying to get to that goal of getting under 200. And slowly but surely we're gonna get there, but I need to step it up this week and I'm actually gonna go eat and then I'm gonna do legs and abs later tonight, but you will see that all in next week's video. If you guys wanna see that, make sure you give this video one big fat like and tell a friend today that Jay from the Cub Scouts is that dude.